It has always been a requirement to undertake an inspection audit to thermostatic taps in healthcare premises at a minimum of every 28 weeks after the initial audit or on a frequency determined by a risk assessment. Within hospitals, there is often the view that there is a cost burden associated with these audits, which can cause further strain on already tight resources. However, recent changes and verifications published in a supplement to HTM 0401 now mean that the audit testing process is quicker but just as effective, and it could also be possible to extend retesting up to 12 months. This video demonstrates the audit testing process. First, turn the tap on full. Secondly, measure and record the mixed water temperature of the outlet at the maximum available flow. The temperature of water should be a maximum of 41 degrees. If the temperature is incorrect, you'll need to adjust the device to achieve the correct temperature according to the manufacturer's instructions. Next, isolate the cold water supply. If there is no flow stream after 5 seconds, you can restore the cold water supply and after 15 seconds, record the mixed temperature again. If the mixed water temperature has deviated by more than 2 degrees C, then the tap has failed. The tap requires adjustment or service work undertaken. The supply to the tap may need to be managed to be within the accepted parameters. If the mixed water temperature is within 2 degrees C of the original temperature, then the tap has passed. If there is a flow stream after 5 seconds, you'll need to collect the water from the tap for 60 seconds. Providing the water collected is less than 120 ml, you can restore the cold water supply. After 15 seconds, check the temperature again. However, if you collect more than 120 ml, you'll need to investigate the supply or adjust the device in accordance with the manufacturer's instructions. So testing your hospital thermostatic taps has never been quicker. Here's the full procedure set against a stopwatch for a tap that passes. So it takes a little over a minute to test a tap that is functioning correctly and another minute or so if you need to run the minute collection test. Furthermore, if you have three consecutive passes, the period of time for retest moves to every 12 months. So testing thermostatic taps is far faster than previous test requirements and if the tap consistently performs well, the need for regular testing reduces.